Hello and welcome back. I am Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more of our Great Britain preview. Preview? No. Uh, tutorial series with Filthy Robot. How's it going? Doing well. Cool. So, uh, why don't you, uh, why, why, why don't you take control of that, that conductieri and, and go do it? You got this. Oh, it's your conductieri. You do it. No, you, no, you, you do it. I, I don't want to do it. I just want to look around the map. You do it. That's what I've been doing. I've been enjoying <laughs> that. <laughs> no, so you, no part of that. I already okay, accept that fine. mission, the manpower mission. Okay. Fair enough. It's uh, unlikely to, to succeed. We've talked about that, but it's really... Well, we have a chance. We have a chance. And I can do that right now. Should I just demand your troops from the nobility to get it back again as soon as possible? Uh, I would wait um, until they are no longer loyal. So I'd wait five months. Okay. Take advantage of that. You, you paid. You somehow managed to earn above 60. Modifier. So, yeah, take it's advantage of it. maintenance modifier, by the way. The default maintenance is going to be whatever it is and then land maintenance modifier minus 10 reduces maintenance by 10 percent is it military or like area maintenance land maintenance modifier land units army yeah it doesn't say land unit it says land we have development could be like the cost of maintaining buildings for all i know so yeah that's a good point land maintenance modifier that's a fair point so yeah our conductieri are just um sieges sie siege demons apparently they just show up yeah. and they siege things down in like three oh ouch that was a painful disease outbreak it was your manpower goal. Uh, remember, stop what? losing me troops. Can't help it. Pollution's getting bigger. I hope that it oh, fires. Okay. I want to conquer this land. By the way, it's been 18 months very soon. Time is going by very quickly right now, so we can get rid of the Condottieri in June of 36. That is in two months. Okay. Okay. It's like we are the aggressor against Muscovy. Lithuania is reinforcing our Condottieri. We are tanking a lot of this damage, but oh well. Let's just be let's just be good Condottieri. Let's rend out just nothing but the finest. You're just trying to sabotage my manpower goal. A little bit, yeah. 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 Thought it was spiteful. It sounded spiteful. Why are we not allowed to shatter? What's up with this? You lost our troops again. No, but our army has no morale, and it didn't didn't run away. Oh, crap. You get our army stack wiped. I'm going to be very upset. Yeah, I would be too. Well, at this point, we're going to send it home because we are allowed to cancel it now. So we'll just wait until they say, hey, you're not doing your job. And then we'll be like, well, yeah. <laughs> then we'll cancel it. Okay. But it's time, to, it's time to march home. So basically, they covered the military maintenance for our troops for about two years while we waited on our truce timer. And uh, it allowed me to queue up, uh, I don't know if you saw all those ships I queued up, like I did. 30 light ships yep. up to our force limit. Yeah, we have 25 more lights in <sighs> progress. Alright, where's the spy network and why aren't we stealing maps? Because <laughs> maps are dumb. No, I want maps. Who are we supposed to steal from to get good maps? Uh, Portugal, probably. It was a good location. Hey, they just cancelled our conductieri. So that's good. That actually black flagged us, which is ideal, because that way we don't have faster military access to get home. Good. So I guess we have free... Where's... Yeah, let's go. What's your goal? What's your goal? Send spy network. Okay. Hey, we got a lot of spy network against Norway. Uh, and he... We have a separate truce with him because he was part of a... One of the coalition wars. But we have... We have three provinces we can claim. I would, I would take the time to claim all three of them. In Norway? Yeah, I'll claim up a couple of them real quick. We need 30 more, so 17 more points, and we'll be done fabricating on Norway. I think he only has, yeah, just three that are in range. Hey, Trader Wallace oh, just died. Unfortunate. Let's take a look at that, placing that. Don't want to lose, guys. Uh, wrong button. There it is. All right, Trader. So, any of the, no that's not the nobility one, right? Trader is diplomacy. Yeah. Trade ooh, ooh, yeah, but which which of the people can give us that? Which of the special interest groups? Um or none of them. It's okay to say none. I think that the military the diplomat, the the, the one from the mil the nobility is a level three better relations over time guy. But there's a level one better relations over time guy. So And do we do really we care? Want points? I don't really yeah. care about diplo points right now. Yeah. If I mean, we depends what our next idea group is. I mean we're pretty much done this idea group. Yeah, if we didn't have access to a better relations over time guy, I would probably take 
the decision with the nobility, but as is, I just pay for the level one because we're ahead of time on Diplotech. We got 700 points. Yeah, but we have a lot of Diplo points and we could potentially do a Diplo idea if we wanted to. Yeah. If Our you want, idea is any good. We're, we're making 30 ducats a month. Uh, let's see. We've got trade, offensive, admin. So we can do any idea group next. Scientific experimentation. You'd have level 10 and you live level 14 of admin to unlock this. How close are we to level 14 admin? No way near, right? Level 10. Wait, level 10 or level 14? Can it make up its mind? You need to have level 10 and need level 14 of administrative technology. What does that mean? You need to have level 10 and need level 14. I, I, I mouse over the ideas. And I look at the next idea group. And it gives me that tooltip. What does it mean? I, I don't know why it says you need to level, level 10. We already have level 10. Okay. So maybe it's just a prerequisite. You need to have the prerequisite idea group and, be, and have level 14 admin technology. Well, right, so. Uh, yeah, so admin unlocks idea groups. You just need to get to tech 14. So we're only two away from that. Oh, it says That's it not... doesn't say you need both. It says you have 10 and need level 14. Wait, yeah, I'm reading it wrong. Okay, I see. So we're at 11, 11, 11, so we need three more. It's going to be a while before we can do that. Yeah, if you were to do another idea group <laughs> right now, I would lean toward either the diplomatic or military ideas because we're mm. coming off of an admin idea, idea group, so we're going to be behind time on admin tech. Between diplomatic and military... um. We'll want to start focusing on whichever one we end up choosing soon. Not yet, because we want to catch up on admin tech first. But um, I might I might lean towards diplomatic ideas. If you don't want to do the colonial type thing, I would lean toward influence ideas. It's a really solid okay. idea group. In which case, if that's the case, I want a better advisor giving us more of these points. Okay? Okay, we have the money for it. Do it. Let's do it. All right, hey. so uh, you want me to take them from the nobility? Yeah, it's going gonna, it's gonna to put them up to a pretty high number. It's going to take them to 78% influence, but that's okay. All right, so we'll go to special interest group, go to the uh, nobility, interaction. I want to recruit a minister from the nobility, right? Yes. Okay. Okay, 78 influence. And I'm going to go back to the court tab, click on the recruit advisor. And I now see Jacob Buckington with 20% improved relationships, which has got to be good, right? It is very, very good. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's the, that's the anti-coalition shit. Yep. So if you look okay. at, uh, like, say... Take, I'm looking at Cologne. They have 77 aggressive expansion. We're covering at 2.8 per year. Go ahead and hire that guy. Now it's at 3.2 per year. So that's it. Might not seem super significant, but trust me, it very, very much is. Okay. And one of the things that's going to be really nice about going for like influence ideas next is that uh, state propaganda, the fourth idea, negative 20% aggressive expansion impact, is really solid. And uh, also, influence ideas finisher is unjustified demands, negative 50% cost. So you can take stuff. I don't promise we're taking that. I want to read them before we make that decision. <laughs> We've got a little bit of time before that. But uh, yeah. it does okay. sound like you have one kind of pre flagged. It's fine. Yeah, it's just if you want to uh, if you want to go Diplo, you need to decide do you want to go Diplo idea group or military idea group is, is the main thing. All right, we pop up. Uh, we can gain. We can, lose we can lose loyalty off the clergy and gain uh, gold. They lose influence, lose gold, or uh, lose loyalty, and lose... They'd be at 35. Is it under 40 is the problem? Yeah. But they'll trend up. What do they do when they're disloyal? They give us no bonuses? Negative 10% tax national tax modifier. And we lose fervor. How much money do we gain? 271 ducats. Okay. There's an interaction we can do. Sacrifice 193 ducats to gain 15 loyalty. So just trade. Okay. Alternatively, we can gain 10 loyalty. With the, I don't want to give them influence, so screw that. So, okay. Yeah. Make it clear no. they need to contribute. Yeah, and then just give them the money right back. <laughs> All right. Give me a second. I'll do that. We come out ahead of that. Oh, yeah. So. Oh, yeah. We gained like 80 ducats in that deal. That's a pretty good deal. I approve. Good. Okay. Waiting on a couple mercs so that we can actually engage this army. Not only did we gain 80 ducats, we cost them 10 influence, which is good. Yeah, they're definitely. still above that 60. I mean, they're not, I guess they're not at 75, but it's generally we can get more things out of them if they're lower influence. So. Yep. We can click more buttons, which are fun. Yep. Buttons are fun. Uh, we have Pomeranian separatists at 80%. They are located where? Stetton. That's annoying. It's an island. The disconnected province. Why are we, what are we being warred by right now? Oh, those are the separatists. They fired. Yeah, we've got to raise maintenance a little bit. Just a couple more months here to get that up. Okay. Royal marriage offer from Sweden. Do we like Sweden? I think we like Sweden. Yeah, fine with that. They are 47. We are 30. We'll accept. Sounds fine. Yeah. Okay. 
You're screwing with my manpower again, aren't you? No, actually. Yeah. I'm using pretty You're much all... You're about to be warring these, right? No. I'm using pretty much all mercs. It's not affecting your manpower. Are you really? Yeah. Ooh, they re-elected Bohemia. Interesting. So, they have no, no legal heir. They're still a steward. Now you'll notice if you hover over the, the ruler of Bohemia, on monarch death, succession war between Great Britain and Burgundy. I wonder who would win that war. <laughs> of course, he's only... Uh, he's 28. He could die. He could die without doing that. Okay, we lost our royal marriage. Is that an issue? Yeah, I would, I would re-up the royal marriage from our direction with him, with Bohemia right now. Okay, so I send him a royal marriage. Yep. Okay. He says yes. He says confirm. Alright, brought the fight to the rebels. Okay, how many people did you lose? Very few. 2,300 infantry. Mostly mercs. mercs. Yeah. Okay. Turn off Scane, and I wonder if we should just head over to Pomerania. Nine unrest, I can't really... Why doesn't it tell me? I would like Ooh. a percentage of our total manpower on the when I mouse over the manpower. That would be useful. I, I have made that exact same request before. So Castile just took Admin Tech 10, which is a important level as Spain because it gives you a... You know, we just we took the national decision to form Great Britain? Yeah. Castile had the same thing to form Spain. So he clicked the button, which instantly integrated Aragon. Wow. And okay. changed him from Castile into Spain. So you'll notice that Aragon is do, gone. Do we have to change our rivals or anything? Or is it auto-update? Yeah, it, auto, it kept, kept him as our rival. He's just Spain now instead of Castile. And he's also integrating Naples, and he's at 796 out of 1,032, so... Then the next four years, Spain's gonna have all of Iberia, except for the Portuguese stuff, and some of Naples as well. Okay. It's a lot of stuff. Yes. This is... Yeah. What are we gonna do about this stupid Stettin province? Uh, Poland hates us, right? They're not gonna give us military access? I think we rivaled Poland. Boats for this type of thing? We have boats that just don't want to leave the army at full maintenance the whole time. Mm. We built a thousand ships. Surely we could uh, afford that now. Yeah. It's just that we don't have enough ships to move the whole army at once. Which just kind of makes it a pain. Alright, well we'll just we'll ferry him over to Stettin, leave him on say 60% maintenance or so. Enough that they can fight. But not so much that we're paying a ton for mercs while we're just sitting here. Hmm. Maybe a 16k stack. It's a pretty sizable army that's going to rebel. So we have how long then? Isn't this the year? Hold on. This is the year. This yeah, is the year we have a... Uh... England. Shoot. You're breaking up. You're breaking up quite oh. a bit. Yeah, our truce expires in November, so we should probably just ignore those rebels then. Focus on going mm. to war with uh, England. Because you're going to want to go to war right, right away, right? Or at least you, you were trying. I don't see you getting to 90% manpower. Am I still broken up? No, not anymore. Okay. Got a claim on Newmark. We just got a sweet claim of Poland. Okay. Yeah, I'm a big fan of just declaring war on on, on England soon. Where do I get a military advisor from? Which uh, which interest group? Annoyingly, they don't exist. Okay. Uh, not for us, at least. There's uh, if you play like a great horde, then they have an estate called the tribes that can give you a military advisor. But most most countries cannot get cheap. Military advisors on command. There are random events that can do it, but okay. for some reason the nobility give you a diplomatic advisor. Where's our army right now? Moving it home for England? Yep. Okay. This is going to bring in Castile, or rather Spain now. Okay. It's alright. There's our truce with Portugal. We should probably pull the navy aside since there's so many little random ships everywhere right now. Of our navy? Yeah. Okay, before England can join the coalition, because he wants to, I can promise you that, 
He's got negative 197 aggressive expansion. Before he can join the coalition, declare war on him right now. Declare war on England? Yeah, Done. otherwise otherwise he is going to... He, he will pull in. They're guaranteed by Burgundy. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. I guess Burgundy's going to join the war too. That's fine. I don't care. We can beat him. Okay. I would probably call in war. both Bohemia and Spain. I okay. don't see any reason to not use... We have 40 favors with Bohemia because we France? helped him in his war. Yeah, sorry, Bohemia and France. Okay. And then we're going to take... Uh, that's the war goal. There you go. Okay. Uh, oh, I'm in Sweden, right? Can't. Don't have them. Don't yeah. have favors. Okay. You are you are breaking up like crazy though. Now, did you declare? There we go. Something's wrong with our internet, our connection here. Uh, I can hear you fine. I can just not talk for a little bit. Okay. All right. We're gonna just smash that army. Oh no, we failed our mission. I can hear you fine still. <laughs> of course we got a disease outbreak or whatever that was. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna just do- oh wow, that was a fast siege. I guess we're done sieging, filthy. Good. That didn't take very long at all. That's Good. the power of a uh, pretty massive siege general versus a very, very weak fort. A very, very weak country, honestly. Yeah. So France probably cannot take Spain and Burgundy on their own. We're gonna- this is gonna be another one of those wars you were hoping for, where we actually need to get onto the mainland and help out. The Good. problem is, our army is very weak. It's not actually at the force limit at all. It's, it's very small relative to what it should be right now. But we do have a fair bit of manpower. I mean, I'll hire up one more real, real cav, and then... I Can usually... raise fort maintenance, by the way? Are we worried about random armies showing up places? I turned on most of the ones that matter, like okay. one over in Dith Martian. We only have one off. It's Scane. We should probably turn that on, too. Yeah, just turn it on. It's safer. Better to be safer. But then again, we have, we have Bohemia to offset Burgundy, so... I don't know. Why does it now say that Sweden's willing to join in our in our, in our war? He may have had a truce, and now he doesn't. Okay. We have 33 favors, so... Is it advantageous to do that? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Against okay. against okay. Castile, our rival, I would do it. Just call him in and... How do I make him do that? Oh, call to arms. Yeah, that's right. So we've got 14 infantry, 4 cavalry, combat width is 27, so I'd prefer to have 23 infantry. And here's where we can either make a choice to spend some of our manpower on infantry, or we could hire some mercs right now. Depends. Long term, it's better to spend manpower if you have it, but if we keep on getting down to zero, then we might not be able to reinforce cannons and, and cavalry after attrition. I mean, we're not anywhere close to zero. We're at 33k right now, which is quite a lot for us. This yeah. probably the highest we've been in decades yeah in this case i uh i would lean toward training up to the combat with with real real troops real infantry all right so let me go ahead and do that how many do you want so we need 27 minus 4 23 total so we need nine more infantry okay so i would just do it from the army just click on the army and then click the plus that way they'll auto merge to it right. simply well i thought you might be moving them around now nah, i'll just wait there until we get the full, full troop count before we, before we try to, like, cross this strait, the Straits of Dover, we want to have a full combat with army ready to fight. Otherwise, our army could get routed and die. We don't want that. Hopefully yeah. Sweden will take care of those rebels, or somebody, if they fire. Why did I get one horse? I don't remember calling him. I did. A horse. I did, because we only had three and we want four. Okay. I think we have enough to fabricate that last claim on Norway. I see you're trying to spy on Portugal because you want maps. That's right. Nice. Maps are important. How long has it been since we hired those heavies from the, the burgers? Can we do that again soon? That's kind of coming up before too much longer. Uh, August of 42. Yeah, it's coming soon. Four years. Hey, all right. A, pop -up. A positive pop-up for once. Okay. Um, gain one stability and 50 diplo. 
or gain 50 prestige and 50 diplo. I would oh, take that's the stability. Yeah, because we're almost prestige capped. That would can we have 130 prestige? No, 100 is the cap. So caps 100, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. You just right. miss it. It's being a chicken. He doesn't want to fight us. Burgundy's navy is hiding. Okay. We're, we're, we're a pretty decent sized navy now. Well, yeah. it's not a lot of heavies, but a shit ton of lights. Yeah, they can't fight all at once, though. Alright, so we have everybody? All the troops are trained? It's like, yes, we've got... No, there's we... one infantry yet to be completed, apparently. Really? Where? Where's Cologne? Uh, I guess I can find him. Let's find him. Then do we care about them? Why does this fucking focus on me? I do find Cologne. Right in here. Somewhere. Ah, uh, it's highlighted. Alright, who's Cologne allied with? They're allied with... A bunch of people hate us anyways, so we give no shits. Alright. We're gaining, uh, power plus five market, uh... Okay, you're still breaking up a lot, but yeah. Okay, uh, we're gonna take a break here then, I guess, because it's that time and because Filthy's robot internet connection is, is dying. Filthy's robot internet Roll. connection, yeah. I'm role-playing a robot. <laughs> Fil yes, the filthy robot. Alright, see you in a bit. <laughs> 